Okay, this is part two of the assignment for Xcode. And there are many ways to display images. And as you can see, your exercise is not displaying all the proper ways of displaying the images. All the images are being displayed with top left edge and at the regular aspect ratio and scale and they're just being cropped. Your assignment is to correct all these cropping errors and make it look like the following images. So just to explain the cropping, this one, the image is square. What's here is a rectangle that is wider than it is tall. So it fits it into this rectangle, but then there's borders. And this is similar, but uh, this one's taller than it is wide. So there's borders on the top and bottom. This one, we have a wider rectangle. However, this is a fit parameter. So it will stretch the image horizontally in order to make it fit. And the whole image fits inside the rectangle. And for this rectangle, it's taller than it is wide. And it is fitted as well. So it's stretched vertically to make it the whole image fit. This image maintains the aspect ratio. And rather than having the borders, it will crop it to fit. So since this is wider, the width fits and the top and bottom parts of the images are cropped. Similarly, this one's taller, so we fit the top and bottom edge and we crop the left and right. This image is just centered and the scale isn't changed. And since the scale isn't changed, all the edges are cropped. This image is fitted to the top left. So the right and the bottom of this image are cropped. Finally, it's useful to be able to flip images horizontally and vertically. So I've provided routines for those and these are just tests. You don't have to do anything with these two. So what do you have to do? As you can see, there's five different definitions for the different ways of displaying images. All of them are set to top left. Your job is to go to the Apple developer documentation and it's the UI class. You scroll down a bit. and you get to this property called content mode. So click on that. And then you see this type here, UI content mode, click on that. And then you see the different modes that you can select. So your job is to pick one of these modes to fit with these definitions. You'll have to test it out and make sure that you have the right one. And you have to do one more thing for this assignment and you have to disable Zoom. Let me just dis show you Zoom. So you can use the pinch gesture. For my test program, I can't do that. So we pinch. And that allows you to expand 
the image or compress the image. Okay, and that's built into the framework. And then you can scroll to look at the different parts of the image or the whole window. To disable the zooming, you need to set self.disable zoom to yes. And you need to do this just before the complete draw routine. And we go over to image screen. And you need to set the disable zoom just before complete draw here. 